Alrighty, good morning. Well, we're waiting for Molly's breakfast to uh, get ready here with the water in it. Yes, we, we're about to have breakfast, baby. Alright, so normally in the morning when I pull her out of her little house, which is down here now for the day, because it normally sits in this corner, you notice there's no sheets on the bed. Yes, they've been thrown up there. I carry extra blankets, which I have here, and I have a extra set of sheets upstairs. Yes, you guessed it. Madam had a little accident on the bed. Unfortunately, that was my fault. I normally get her out, we say her lows, and I take her outside right away. Well, this morning I decided, because she did it yesterday, where we just, you know, we said our hellos, and I petted her and played with her. Well, I did not really play, because playing gets them excited, but I was just sitting there petting her and whatnot, and we were, you know, talking. Ah, it's kind of weird, eh? But all of a sudden, she decided she had to go real bad, and so anyways, luckily, there's, it was right here. There's nothing, there's nothing on the mattress. It got all soaked up by, uh, because I have several falsa blankets and the sheets soaked it up and I saw it right away and I took her off the bed she didn't do any duty on the floor but she stopped right away and I was able to get a towel on it and whatnot and I like got any un underneath the sheets so something to be expected when puppy training in a truck so I, I that was my fault I broke the routine and that's one big thing with puppies, you cannot break the routine. They get used to it, and you gotta stick with it. So my bad, my puppy had a duty on the beddy. But we're gonna wash the sheets today. Here, puppy, here. Uh, we're gonna be in Kitchener later this morning, around noon, just before noon. What I'll do is I'll take the sheets and blanket inside and get them washed so they don't uh, start to stink. And, uh... We'll put another set of sheets and whatnot on the bed. So that's just the way she is. We don't have a we have a reload today, but it doesn't deliver until tomorrow in Whippy, so it's only a few miles. Not a big deal. So that gives us this afternoon to do whatever we have to do. We're gonna go to Walmart probably. And uh yeah, so hey Molly. And and and, and you're destroying your house. There was a velcro piece here, and it's now here. So I'm going to have to come up with a better, uh, like it's still got the one Velcro on it, so it's still going to hold the door up here. But, any feisty? Any feisty? So, yeah, eat your breakfast, come on. So, anyways, we're going to do breakfast. Alright, time doing. for Miss pea head to come outside. And we can get driving. Okay. What I like, I love the step on here, which is nice. She knows to sit on it. Or stay on at any rate. So far she does. She hasn't tried to jump down. Oopala. Let's go for just a little quick pee break here. No, why why do you gotta go down there and then around and back up again? Seriously? Come on. Let's go make pee-pees. Yeah, that a girl. She's such a good girl. Now we're just going to walk around this little green space here and see if we can get her to go one more time. Maybe even a poop poop again. And then we're going to roll. Right, we got our coffee. Ole. Mm. Okay, madam's decided to go back to eating. Oh, I disturbed you, did I? Sorry. No, it's not treat time. No. No, 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 no. It's not treat time. You finish your brekkie. Come on. Look at all the brekkie you got here. Oops. Oops. Now Dad just screwed that up, didn't he? Here. Yeah. Go eat your brekkie. Okay. Alrighty. We we're a little on the warm side and we're in Kitchener. And this is our only decent patch of grass in the yard. There is some outside that we can get to, but while we're in the yard, this is our only place to run, and it's quiet. It's Saturday, so there's not a lot of traffic, so I got her off the leash. And she usually likes to tear along here once she gets going. I don't think she will today. It's a little bit warm, 
But she's a little bit warm. Hey, boo boo, come on. So we just got to get her to walk on here. No, oh, over here, come on. That's it, baby. Sniff, sniff, sniff. A baby and the cooler weather she likes to get tearing along here so well, we're just on a little outside break alrighty boys and girls we are going to do something that we do for our bigger dogs and this is going to be a very first for Madame Molly so we are going to give her her very first little bit of ice cream it's vanilla, don't worry. She's not getting the chocolate that I got from Dairy Queen. And she won't get all of that. She's only going to get about half. So we're going to get ourselves set up here so that we can give her some ice cream. Not too sure if she wants to come out or not. Come on. Come on, sweetie. Why don't you come out? Come out. Come on, baby. Yeah, <laughs> she's definitely not sure. She'll definitely lick it off my finger, though. See? Look. Ooh. What's that? What's that, baby? You gonna come out? Come on, Ma. Come on, baby. Molly, come on, babes. Alrighty, here we go. There you go, some ice cream, baby. Ooh, look at that. Mmm. We're not too sure, are we? Nummy, nummy, nummies. Mm -mm -mm. She definitely won't be eating all of that. That'll make her tummy sick. So we'll just let her eat a little bit of it. Hey, is that yummy, Molly? Mmm, your very first ice cream. We don't want her tummy to get sick. If she eats too much, it'll be an upset tummy. Hey. Yeah, <laughs> it's good, huh? My big dogs would have had that slurped up in like a second. Alrighty. Oh, that was good. Yummy DQ. Okay, so before anyone gets upset that I gave her too much, she's, uh, she didn't hardly eat any. I mean, she licked all the surface pretty much. I dumped a little bit of chocolate in there to give it some flavor, but I don't think she's too crazy about it. Either that or maybe it was too cold for her little tongue. I don't know. But she decided she'd much rather go in her house and sleep. She's a little tired. I don't know if maybe with the heat she's not feeling too good today. So it is quite warm out. We've been out a few times, but that heat is quite a bit. I mean, we got the AC going in here, so it's not too bad in here. <coughs> but uh, yeah, she's uh, she hardly ate any. So it's not like I would have gave her the full thing anyways. But she did eat a little bit. So she got her first taste of it. Hey, Molly. Yeah. You want to take a little nappy naps now? Yeah, it looks that way. Alrighty then. Alright, we're out for our, basically our final little jaunt here. <laughs> we're by our only patch of grass, but Madam loves to run this thing. Whoa, through the bush, around, and then she comes right back out again. Boom. Run, do it again. Do it again. Zoom. Got to get that energy burnt off. Whoa. Hey, hey Molly, go run, go run, go run. <laughs> come on baby, come on baby, come on. <laughs> hey silly, go run, go run, go run. No biting, no. 
Go run. Here she goes. She utilizes the grass space, that's for sure. <laughs> hey, silly. Go run. Go run. Stop. Go run. <laughs> you just have so much energy. And then she's got to rip the grass up. She doesn't need it. She just rips it up. She's lawn cutting. Helping them trim the lawn. Hey. Go run. Go run. Hey, silly Billy. Hey, my silly girl. Hey, killer of the grass. <laughs> hey, craziness. Hey, craziness. Hey, okay. Well, we went over and checked out a few of the Kenworth, or the Kenworth, uh, a couple of the Peterbilts. Uh, a few of them are really badly beat up inside. Hey, over here. There's the one Kenworth there I wouldn't mind having. It's got a the studio type bunk, but it's not the studio bunk. It's not the big one, but it does have the the bed that goes into a couch, which I thought was really nice. No, I kind of like it, but it's an older truck, so. Hey! Phew, there she goes, in the bush, out the bush. Ain't hey, crazy. Burn off that energy. I'm going to sleep good tonight. I'm hoping. Hey, you gonna sleep good tonight? You gonna sleep? Oh, you found paper. Of course you found paper. Of course you did. Yeah, we'll throw that in the garbage. Yeah, no need for you to have the paper. Oops, and I totally missed the garbage. The wind took it. Where are you going? Come on. Hey. Oh. <laughs> you crazy girl. Hey. You gotta take one more pee. Would be nice. And then we could go to the truck. Right? All right, come on, Missy. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's head towards the truck. Let's see if we can even get you in the truck. You're so full of piss and vinegar tonight. Hey, come on. Hey, silly. Come on. Leave the pine cones alone. Oh, <laughs> watch it. You're going to ruin your paws there, kiddo. Hey. Slowing down a bit? Nope, of course not. Come on. Over here. Come on, Molly. Come on. That's not our truck. Over here, Molly. No, leave that. Come on. Molly, this way. <whistles> Molly. Hey. <whistles> Come on. Silly girl. <laughs> yes. Over this way. Come on. <whistles> Look at you go, miss, full of energy. Huh? Over this way. Come on, Molly. Come on. <laughs> there you are. You went underneath the truck. 
You crazy? Over here. Come on. I can hear you. Come on, Molly. <laughs> there you are. Come here. <laughs> yeah, you silly. Come here. Come on. I got you now. <laughs> oh, your heart's just a racing 2,000 miles a minute. Mm. You're crazy. Watch your head. Oh, yeah, you. Craziness. I get her off that sand before she destroys her paws. Holy crap. Talk about get up and go.